Hi, I'm Noel from 4D Systems. In this video, we will see how to control three LEDs connected to a Forduino from a web browser. The Forduino is configured as a web server and is controlled from a web browser which is a client. Before we start, I will discuss how the process of communicating with the Forduino and a web browser. The user enters the IP address of the Forduino given by the wireless router which can be seen on the display of the Forduino. The Forduino answers by giving data to the browser which indicates the state of the digital pins 11 to 13. The state of the pins are also displayed on the LCD. If the user enters the IP address together with the pin to be controlled, the Forduino parses the packet and toggles which pin is to be controlled. For this project, we will need a Forduino, 3 LEDs, 3 resistors, breadboard, and some jumper cables. For the complete code, kindly visit our website and click on the Forduino project samples. Open it with Workshop 4, see that this project uses basic graphics. The skeleton code contains the relevant code required for the communication between the microcontroller and the GPU running the touch display. This part of the code initializes the serial port which will communicate with the Wi-Fi module. This part initializes the Wi-Fi module and the display processor. This part configures the digital I.O. ports 11, 12, and 13 to output. While this part of the code connects the Wi-Fi module to the router with the correct SSID and password, this part of the code checks if there's data received by the serial port connected to the Wi-Fi module. This part parses the data to determine the connection ID and the pin to be controlled. This part toggles the pin and displays the status on the LCD and also on the web browser. Finally, this code closes the connection from the web browser. After getting the code, connect your Forduino to the PC using a micro USB cable. Make sure that the Forduino comms is connected to the right port in the comms tab. After this, click the compile and load button. This will load the code into your Forduino. After connecting to your router, you can now see what's happening on the Forduino by looking at the display. Now try to change the parameter type on the browser to see the three LEDs turn on and off. I hope you learned about the Ford Reno module and wireless communication. If you are interested with more projects using a Ford Reno, please check out our YouTube channel and subscribe. Thanks for watching.